morning welcome back 6 a.m and it's another beautiful morning so today i'm in uh, lynn i thought we'd give uh, the north of cheshire warrington area a bit of love so we're just south of warrington and uh, yeah so and we're right on the um, trans pennine trail here if you remember a while back we were down at Widnes and we were on the Trans Pennine Trail there. I feel it's it's calling me, it's taunting me. <laughs> Maybe one day we'll go and do the whole thing. Maybe. Anyway, so today we're just gonna have a little explore around Lim, down the Trans Pennine Trail a bit, down through the village and, and around. Um, it's very pretty around here. So come along and join me. Okay. Let's get going. Welcome to Lim. Okay, so we're just south of Warrington here in Cheshire and we're starting by heading down this section of the Trans Pennine Trail. It's a this bit's a disused railway that used to run between Warrington and Altrincham and the uh, train line services loss is our gain because it's a great spot for a walk or a run. Up ahead here we're going to take a right and head into Lim. So at its heart Lim is a small village and it's surrounded by all these hamlets. Uh, in the middle there's um, a dam so Back when they built the main road, the A56, I think it was 1824, they uh, dammed the uh, Bradley Brook and it's created a, a lake. So we're going to have a, a run around the lake. It's a popular tourist spot. And then we're going to head back up to the Bridgewater Canal and have a run down there. And then from there, we then head back by rejoining that uh, Trans Pennine Trail. Anyway, here we are, we're in the middle of Lim. So as always, there's a map and more information about the route up on my website, so do go check that out. And if you enjoy the route, please do uh, give it a like, that helps more people find it. And if you're new, welcome, please consider clicking the subscribe button. There are new routes every week. Right, just sit back now, we're heading for the dam, and it's beautiful this morning. Cold, clear morning. Choices, choices. I think we'll do the wishing bridge. Well, if we're crossing the wishing bridge, I suppose we ought to make a wish. <laughs> uh, a run adventurer wish. I wish I had a million subscribers. I guess that's a good segue to quickly just talk about Patreon. So Patreon subscribers get early access to all the content and exclusive content. So if you'd like to support Run Adventure, go and have a look at Patreon. Uh, it would really help us to be able to create more content for you.
just lovely this morning. Just look at the, the sun low. It's beautiful. Okay, we've reached the Bridgewater Canal. You may remember we've run a section of the Bridgewater Canal further down before, down near Runcorn. So yeah, it was very useful for transferring coal um, back in the day. Now it's just a lovely, peaceful place for a walk or a run. And the beautiful thing about canals are they just cut a swathe right through the countryside. One minute you're in a town or a village, the next minute, we just across open fields. We're going to head under the M6 now. So yeah, there we are just, as you go head, begin to head up the ramp onto the Thelwall Viaduct, that's where we are.
okay all done that's uh yeah really nice different okay yeah uh, i'm gonna head back home for a bit of breakfast and i'll see you all next week i think we might head down to chettleton next time see you next time folks <laughs>